Thank you for being here. I'm really, really grateful. I know there's some going on stuff, stuff going on at YRF. I hope everyone's here. Um, you know, we uh, we launched uh, EMI Records uh, three or four months ago with the dream of creating a bridge, which would be with the Bollywood film uh, could be born, and whether it was promoted as a dependent music or was promoted. Through the, uh, through the medium of Bollywood, this would be the birthing place. Uh, in the last four months, I'm very proud to announce that our first artist, Anmol Malik, uh, I'm not going to say daughter of legendary Anu Malik because she's her own girl. We actually saw her a few years ago. She came to see us and, you know, uh, writes about right. And I'm really happy that this is the time where we could put Anu and Anmol and Mohit and everyone who's part of this uh, cycle of EMI Records India for the first time to create a song which could be mounted like a Bollywood film. The problem with independent music is that our jitna bhi kare is not enough. You know, because mainstream radio will not play you, mainstream TV will not play you. But um, it's very important that music, which is, it doesn't matter where it comes from, whether it's independent or it's Bollywood, but the point is it needs carriage. I'm proud to say for the first time, at least in my career, I've seen an independent song not connected to a Bollywood film have the kind of scale and mount that this song has. There is no difference between the next single of Bollywood that launches next week and this song. It's for the first time. It's on television, it's on radio, it's on internet, print, uh, out of home, in film, you name it. Some by a Bollywood act, act director, some by reasonably Bollywood people, but it has nothing to do with the film. So I'm very excited. Thank you for being here today. Thank you for supporting us as always. Um, write stuff about it because this music needs a voice and you my friends in the media without you we can't do much so you know give us all your thrust all your love all your push that you can and i'm really really excited i think i have to call mohit or are you going to call mohit okay so here my records basically was created like she said as a joint venture between us and mohit suri mohit's a dear friend um unlike bollywood directors he's one guy who i know is very very passionate about his craft never thinks about money never thinks about time never thinks about anything but his craft I'm really proud to call him my partner and my friend and my brother, ladies and gentlemen, Moit Suri. <laughs> Carrier of mics. Wow. <laughs> All right. Uh, wow. It's great to be here uh, simply because uh, 11 years back, I started my career at 22, 23, 22. You know, way back then, uh, Anuji was a part of that way back then also uh, and we did great music like Agar Do Mil Jao at that time in Zaire and for Kalyu. Uh, but back then there was a friend of mine who uh, was a new artist and I remember this one moment where he um, was doing an extraordinary song for my film and who had at one time like all people had requested that he gets promoted, he gets positioned, he develops a name of his own. Uh, I tried a lot at that time, being 22, 24, uh, he, him being 22, me being 24, that if I could do something for him, but way back then, uh, who would listen to a new director and uh, who would listen to a new artist back then? So somewhere down in that helplessness was that decision that every time I met, I would work with new musicians, new singers, new lyric writers, uh, new composers, and somewhere get them that due credit and it is... I thank Devraj and Vineet uh, who came up to me three months back and told me that they were giving me this platform that I could just continue following my dream, uh, which was EMI Records India. So thank you guys a lot. Thank you very much. This is something I genuinely believe in and thank you for taking this dream of mine forward. 
but that one moment that helped talent no matter what you do will find its place and now 12 years later when i'm working with anmol i see that same spark that same initiative which i've seen in all through my career whenever it was when i launched not launched but when origit was rediscovered or whether it was mithun rediscovering himself or ankit or manoj over here who's even written this song uh, all these people uh, genuinely i would like to thank you all because you all have been the stars i have not worked with big actors or uh, big names but i have but the musicians and the composers and all the people have been the stars of my life i wouldn't be standing here if it wasn't for you all this is my way of saying thank you emr records india is my way of saying thank you to you all guys uh composed originally by coldplay but reproduced by mr anu malik you couldn't get anyone better than that written by manoj mitra sir who's who's now i think after this being going to be on a hat trick with me after galia now he's doing this you couldn't get better than him and sung uh, sung by anmol malik herself and stars my friend mohit marwa who's waiting over there really shy but it's your time to take stage now with spent uh, spending no more time i present the video to you guys lame all right um i actually wanted to you know tell you about the journey of this song um which makes me feel really blessed because coldplay has been my favorite band as long as i can remember and paradise has been my favorite song of this but i want to take this moment right here this stage to actually make it a thank you speech of sorts uh because i want to thank every single real hero behind this video it's not me it's everybody else who is standing there i'm going to thank mohit sir because he's been absolute magic for now i want to thank mohit marwa for putting up with me and because i have no expressions in my eyes i want to thank vineet sir and devrat sir for spearheading emi records india without you guys without you rock stars this would not be possible <laughs> because this song whatever it is lyrically is because of manoj sir's talent and now lastly i want to thank always from the bottom of my heart i'm blessed to be your daughter i keep getting asked this question all the time what is the blessing and what is the pain of being anu malik's daughter you know what i don't care you you are my rock and i love you and thank you thank you for being there with me always to pick and think we have gone through a lot together to come to this point and i want you right now to come here Woo! Woo!